Hey, what's going on, guys? I just wanted to show you my build. Yes, I'm Slim Shady. Don't hate on me. Uh, what I'm pretty much going to be showing you guys today is um, my hybrid build, which is kind of like a mixture between water and fuel. Now, it's working for me because, as you can see, my money is going up slowly but shortly. And my efficiency is actually on a lower than usual kind of you know number percentage but I am seeing a significant amount of money added to my build as of what it was earlier because I was messing around with some stuff and I figure you know why not put a video out for people that are unaware or don't know how to make any kind of you know smack so as you can see I have a steampunk overdrive I have a steam engine which is an upgrade of 9.75 times adds fuel too I have a microscope now I can mess around with this all day man probably get like up there in the ranks or whatever but you know as you can see I'm 42 36 it's fluctuating between the efficiency and what I have so, um, it's going up and down, pretty much, because I don't know what to do, and I'm just running around here like a crazy man, figuring stuff out like Albert Einstein, trying to actually put my, you know, test to the max, see what I could do to make it better. Um, so anyways, we got the, uh, okay, can I actually highlight it? Oh, microscope, macroscope, <laughs> you know, whatever. It is what it is. We got the um, Metro Plunk, Metro Punk Clockwork, which is an overlock, and the upgrade is 60.92 times. Now, like I was saying, guys, this is a mixture between water and fuel. So, I mean, this is a, this is what it is, you know. It's making me a little bit more money than what I was doing earlier, but and. Uh, I'm happy about that. Very happy about that. Because the boy wants to make some money here. I want to upgrade. So let's go upstairs. Let's just go up and test things out. I'm going to play around with this game a little bit more after I get off the video. Because there's some stuff I still need to figure out and learn. Um, I'm pretty sure I can hit a max number here. I just got to playing around with it um, I was looking at some videos acid pools eh, not something I really want to use eh, all right so over here I have the abyssal chains removes fire and acid adds wet I got perfect lawn I got um, the tundra and I got Billy's fish tank. Over here I have sunstone pylon. So, I, you know, I mean, I'm just testing stuff out. Don't hate on the video if you don't think I'm doing that great. I'm only into the game a day already. So, not really too good at it. This is like one of my uh, best drops over here. It's called the Gavelin. Galvelin. <laughs> I cannot pronounce the word. Galvanic Surge. <laughs> it's like the best item I got right now so don't hate on it that's all I'm saying I got the Royal Castle Keep wet vulnerable fire immune air vulnerable and two times fire it's only gonna get wet anyway so I figure I add that there uh, duration rotation dripper kind of good for water nature's embrace good for water so um you're looking at something that's in the making and uh you know i mean it is what it is what you see is what <laughs> i threw off the map didn't mean to do that i did not mean to do that 
you know, of course, someone could sit here all night and get the best items because it's a randomly generated game. I already have 21,000 rolls. So, I mean, what you see is what you get. Alright, thank you for watching, folks. Peace!